Hello everybody, this is Screwdriver at Bell CB. Got a repair report today for Lewis in Texas. Sent me this Galaxy 99, had no receive and no transmit. Further investigation inside the radio showed that the voltages off of the transmit switching transistor was sending out, say, 4 volts all the time. Kind of half of what it usually would do if you transmitted. But that left it kind of transmitting and receiving at the same time those transmit voltages shut down the receiver. So when I replaced that diode, the all the time transmit went away and it started receiving fine. Still no switching on transmit though. When you go to switch, there was nothing there. Checking out the switching voltages for the transmit going to the chip, they were missing and further investigations found another bad diode D114 shunting out the voltage for that switching circuit so now it switches the transmit fine and receive fine I did a, a course of alignment on uh, your meters and stuff in your receiver also fix your channel selector had the wrong clip inside kinda hanging off of there and you had the LED for the nitro knob way in the back so you could hardly see it so I brought that up to the front, mounted it, and, and fixed the clip on that. Alright, let's check out the transmit here a little bit. We got a 10 watt. 8 watts all the way up. 1 watt all the way down. So 8 again. 50 watt slug. 20, and there's 30. Audio, check, 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 check. One, two, three, four, five. Audio. One, two, three, four, five. Audio. Check, 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 check. Audio. Okay, and another sideband. Audio. One, two, three, four, five. Check, 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 check. One, two, three, four, five. Audio. All right. This light's not out. Somebody put a blue LED in there, and that's what you got for a meter light. All right, there you go. 